Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, my name is Yvonne and for today's video, this is actually one that I've been pretty excited to do and it's, um, I don't know, I always find these kind of videos helpful, especially when you're trying to like buy new clothes or trying to just add new clothes into your closet and this video is going to be on, on kind of just finding those timeless and classic pieces to build your wardrobe. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. Okay, so like I said, this video is going to be, you know, me kind of showing you what I think are closet essentials. Those timeless pieces, you know, that you can just reuse over and over again to just create multiple outfits. And those kind of pieces that you'll never really get tired of. I think having those kind of things in your closet will make it so much easier and so much better when it comes to like putting together some outfits. So I have some right here in the back already and these are kind this isn't everything that I have in my closet. These are just some of the pieces that I think are essential. So these pieces right here, I um, these tank tops that I have right here, I think having a tank top in your closet, whether it's a neutral color or any other of your favorite colors, I think these are a must because they're super easy to layer, especially during the winter, fall, or spring. You can throw um, a cardigan over them, a button up, a light jacket, or just, you know, anything else you might want to. I think this, you know, it's super easy to just kind of style tank tops, especially when they're neutral colors. This one that I have right here is one of my favorites and it's actually kind of more of a, a cropped um, tank top and this one is from Target. And then this one was is also from Target and this has more of like a thicker strap. And this one is a little bit longer and usually this one I just tuck it in into some jeans and I have worn this one with like a cardigan or just like a, a sweater. It's during the winter and during the summer, I just wear it like this, you know, with some jeans or some shorts. And then this is one of my favorite tank tops. And this one is a different material than the other two. These are just more like cottony tank tops. And this one kind of almost has like a dressy kind of feel to it, more like linen. It just looks different. So this one I feel is easier to style like when you're going to go out or just, you know, work or whatever the case may be. You know, you can layer this one with like a blazer or a cute cardigan you know just to make it make a cute little put together outfit so that i think tank tops are essentials in your closet so the next item that i think is an essential piece for for your wardrobe is having a t-shirt or t-shirts whether you know they're black white or any other neutral color um having tank top not tank tops having t-shirts like this you can create very casual and chic outfits you can style them with some blue jeans and throw a black blazer over it and some cute little sneakers or just kind of style this with you know some shorts so these you know you can create those very casual outfits without you know putting too much work into it so so having a neutral color t-shirt whether it's you know your size whether it's fitted or oversized just having one of those is an essential piece in your closet up next is a long long sleeve shirt whether it's white or black i personally like a black um long sleeve because to me I, I don't know i just find this so much easier to style a black tee i don't really have to worry about you know it staining or it being too see-through i can wear this one to work i can wear this one out when i go to you know target or whatever so this one is a very versatile shirt for me i can style it with some black high-waisted jeans or you know blue high waist jeans some shorts or leggings and you know throw over a cardigan or a blazer so just having a black long sleeve or white or any other neutral color is very is going to make it so much easier to just you know make those cute little outfits like i said very effortless so ha i think this is one of my favorites in my closet because it's just super easy for me to style it so the next essential piece is having a white button up I actually find button-ups to be very easy to style since this one is a little oversized. Um, this one I actually got from my brother and it's just like a regular white button-up that you, I don't know, this one's a slim fit but it is oversized on me. But anyways, like I was saying, this one is very easy to style. I can just button it up and put some leggings over it, maybe some, I mean, wear it with some leggings or some biker shorts. Um, I can also tuck it in into my jeans and just kind of like make it look like bubbly you know kind of like that i can also 
like I said, style, tuck it into my jeans, but instead of buttoning it up, I can just kind of tuck it into the sides to kind of give it a different look, which I'm pretty sure you guys have seen me do in previous videos. That's how I've styled it before. I don't button it, I just kind of tuck it into the sides and it just kind of creates that look. You can roll up the sleeves, you can wear a tank top underneath and some shorts and just wear this over, just kind of layer it. So having a, a neutral button up is gonna make it very easy to style. You're gonna have lots of outfit options. So that's always fun. So the next piece is having a, I wanna say a neutral knit sweater, whether it's a fine knit sweater or a chunky knit, you know, everybody has their preferences. I really like this one. This one I actually got for Christmas this year, but this one is super warm. And I think when they're just, you know, a neutral color, it's a lot easier to style them with different things because they're neutral so they really don't clash with different colors um but yeah this one kind of is almost like a mock deck but it's kind of like um rolled over so it does sit a little bit higher than the crew neck but at the same time it's not as high as a turtleneck so this one i love it it's really warm and cozy and usually this one i just wear it with some high-waisted jeans and i pair it with some converse or some boots and I just wear a simple little gold dainty necklace and that's how I usually wear it with either my hair down or up and it just kind of creates a very simple outfit for me. This dress right here, I wanna say is also a timeless piece. You know, this one is yellow so it's not so neutral but I feel like this is the, per the perfect um, spring slash summer dress. You can layer it, you can you know wear it with a long sleeve underneath, a, t a white, t-shirt underneath and maybe throw over a, a light jacket um, and style it with either some sandals some boots like doc martin some chunky boots or you know those some casual little white sneakers and you can just create like really cute little chic outfits with it um you can also just wear it as it is with some sandals maybe a few golden necklaces just to kind of tie in the whole look together but yeah i feel like um having a good little dress um would be perfect for summer or spring. Obviously, you know, color choices depend on you. I really like this little yellow one. I really don't have a lot of yellow things in my closet, and I like it just because it's not see-through, but at the same time, it's light enough that, you know, it gives you, like, those spring summery vibes. So having a cute little dress in your closet will also, um, it's also a very, like, timeless piece. Having some, I want to say some light jackets for especially for that for that time that we're starting to get warm you know like summer spring will be will come in handy and also in the fall where you're still kind of like in that weird weather where it's cold in the morning and hot at the day you know so having light jackets will also be easy you know to lay just throw over any outfit that you have especially when they're neutral colors like your jackets it's easier to just style them obviously um, and also for the winter having those thicker jackets that are also very versatile and they will pretty much go with any outfit that you have so talking about light jackets i have this one this is kind of like a beige color and this one is from ross um this one i love it it's kind of have it has like that utility kind of look to it it does have like these little strings right here that you can cinch it at the waist or you can just have it loose i like to keep it a little bit cinched just to kind of create a little bit more um make it look like I have a waist, I guess. But anyway, I absolutely love it. It's a neutral color, so it, like I said, it just goes with every outfit. Um, you can either you know dress it up, dress it down, however you wanna style it, absolutely up to you. But this one, I usually just throw it with either an all black outfit, a very casual outfit, and then just call it a day. But yeah, this is one of my favorites. I love the color, it, it's also very thin. So this one is perfect for like summer, and spring and maybe part of fall but for winter it's not a good jacket to wear just because it's really thin and I'll freeze in this so another jacket that I think is also perfect for I want to say spring and fall maybe summer like at night or something not during the day but anyways this it's a moto jacket I feel like a moto jacket is just a very timeless piece you can Dress it up, dress it down, it all depends on how you're feeling, what outfit you're wearing for the day. But yeah, this one is a kind of like a suede material and this is from H&M. And it, it is a small, it's, you know, because it's a neutral color, so it literally goes with anything. 
Um, you can just wear a knit sweater over it, throw this over. Maybe if you have a tank top and it's like spring or something, you get cold, throw it, throw it on. But yeah, this one is one of my favorites. I absolutely love the details on it, like the zipper. Like I said, I just literally found out that it's like a slanted zipper versus an up, like, you know, just straight up and down. So I absolutely love that now. But I also love like the details that it has, like just they're simple, but yet it stands out. So this is why I absolutely love this. It's just one of those pieces that I feel like you need or just any other like black little jacket. And for winter, I think this one's perfect. This is just like a very long coat it's and it's just great you know so it's neutral so it can literally go with any of your outfits that you have whether you're dressing it up dressing it down having a good neutral coat for winter is gonna make it easier for you to just you know style it i guess because there's times where you're wearing a cute outfit but then you put on a coat and it just kind of throws off your outfit so i think having a neutral coat um and like a very kind of i want to say neutral style if that makes sense because this is just a very long basic coat so i feel like it's not gonna take away from your outfit and it's just kind of kind of just tie it all together and then i do have these paper bag pants that that are also from shein and these have the but um the belt already like sewed onto the sides and these are super easy to style for work or just you know you know just make them cute like for the summer or spring um, last time I styled these was with a knit sweater and I just rolled them up a bit and put on some white converse. I've also styled them with like dressy shirts for work and some flats. And it all depends on how you're feeling that they are or what kind of outfit you're going for. But yeah, that's how usually having a good pair of dressy pants um, in your closet is a must. Especially, you know, if you, wear, if you need them for work or you just kind of want dressy clothes for I don't know, a special occasion. And also, I think having a good pair of black jeans, of black high-waisted jeans in your closet is a must. I feel like sometimes black jeans look a lot better and more, it makes you look more put together than blue jeans, if that makes sense, but that's just me. But yeah, this is a, these are from American Eagle, but I actually thrifted these and they're like literally brand new. But yeah, these are high-waisted and they're super easy to style. Literally, when I don't have anything to wear, I'll reach for a black pair of jeans and my black long sleeve shirt and some sneakers. And I'll just put on like a cute little gold necklace and that's it. And that's what I'll wear for the day. But yeah, these are super easy to style. You can style them with any shirt, obviously, any shoes, boots, over the knee boots, sandals, whatever, you know, whatever shoe or whatever shirt you want to wear it with. I feel like black jeans um, are just a good um, timeless piece. And these are skinny jeans. And I know I've been seeing all over TikTok that skinny jeans are going out of style. But at the same time, I really don't care because I really like these jeans. So I'm going to keep on wearing them. Another piece that I think is timeless is having a good pair of stray lake jeans. Um, these are ripped. So I'm in the process of looking for some that aren't ripped just so I can wear those maybe to work because I can't wear these to work but anyway these are some mom jeans and these are thrifted but I think since you know mom jeans are, and straight leg jeans are very in right now having a good pair of mom jeans or just straight leg jeans that are either blue you know your normal blue denim or just black um, are gonna be essential when creating those like trendy outfits um i've styled these with my white button up and then you can also wear them with like you know just a cute cropped tank top so having a good pair of straight leg jeans in your closet will be is a must especially if you want to switch up your style if because for me i wear a lot of skinny jeans literally every day so having that in my closet also it gives me more choices you know playing with them kind of style them and styling them differently seeing what i like what i don't like so i don't know i enjoy, i like having a good pair of mom jeans and also having a good pair of blue denim jeans these are high-waisted um these are just normal skinny jeans like i said i do like skinny jeans i'm gonna keep on wearing them but i also want to get more you know different style of jeans just to try them out and you know switch up my looks and whatnot but yeah so those were all my essential pieces like i said this is what i consider to be essential for my closet 
so just finding those um timeless and classic pieces like for me i think having a lot of neutrals especially like long sleeve short sleeves tank tops having them to be a neutral color will make it a lot easier to style it with a lot a, a lot more things that you might already have in your closet like maybe some sweaters you know i don't know cardigans i i don't know but anyways it'll just make it a lot easier when they're neutrals but at the same time it just all depends on what colors you like and what you're kind of go trying to go for what kind of looks you're trying to create and whatnot so i hope this video inspired you to look go into your closet and find those timeless pieces that you might already own and just style them differently layer them dress them up dress them down you know just try different things don't be afraid to try different things you know it's always fun kind of playing dress up and then seeing what looks good on you what you like what you don't like you know what i mean but with that being said that was everything for today's video and like I said, I hope you find this video helpful and if you like it, please don't forget to hit the thumbs up or como dice mi mamá, el dedito arriba. Um, and please don't forget to subscribe. I would love for you to join my little YouTube familia and with that being said, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!